Good morning, folks. Uh, the, the update for Hydroneer came out, so we'll be playing that today when it finishes patching because for some reason my computer decided it didn't want to do that. <laughs> and I only noticed that like right before I was getting ready to go live, so it's still got like three to five minutes of just kind of vibing. So, uh, yeah. Well, that's fine. We can uh, just... Um, hang out a little bit until it's done and then we can start the game but before we start hanging out before we start playing the game uh we're gonna go, i'll go ahead and um say that i'm still f i'm i've started and i'm still fundraising for the lgbtq freedom fund which helps um, lgbtq folks in bail get bail and legal defense and that kind of stuff and really cool really cool group really cool cause um, if you're able to help with that, I have below my stream. I should have a um, a donate button you can press, and um, I have a command uh, xwh point donate that has that link. I also have a chatbot that shares it every once in a while, and I have on on the stream whenever the screen is up, there'll be a QR code that you can scan with like your phone or otherwise with a device you're using to. Um, also be able to donate that way anyway you choose to do so is awesome and i appreciate you for it and i don't have the game up yet but i'll at least put this up so that you can see the qr code and all that because let's see this patching just got like two minutes left it's a little bigger than i was expecting it to be because the, the file oh i think i see why the uh file itself Pat, the patch file itself was like 89 megabytes, but I think it was like redownloading the entire fucking game or some shit. You know, you know how Steam is. <laughs> Steam is a, a fucking mess. Oh boy, I sure do love uh, Steam. I mean, Steam's hardly the worst like game launcher software I've ever used, admittedly. But it's still annoying that my computer just didn't do the you know the update like it was probably meant to do. So I'm just kind of scrolling through, uh, scrolling through the Twitter. The, the 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 hellscape of known as Twitter. Uh, right. I mean, I've got I've got Spotify open. I guess you could probably play a song or something. But that thing is like, there's like. 10 sec or like 20 seconds left so we're just gonna hang out i'll drink coffee from my coffee cup that one of my co-workers at my new job got me for uh the holiday they got me a gift way before the 25th and so i just was like okay i'll open it. i don't really fucking care about christmas i don't really want to celebrate or do be part of that i mean i'll get gifts for people but that's like it I don't really want to go to like holiday parties and put up a Christmas tree and all that garbage. Uh, but one of my my coworker got me a little like RuneScape like the themed coffee cup with like the right click dialogue from the from RuneScape, but it has a cup of coffee. So I was like, oh, that's kind of cool. I appreciate that. I was it came I kind of wasn't expecting it. So I'll probably get him, like, I'll probably get I don't know what to get him. I'll probably get him, like, a 20 so he can get something he wants. Because I don't really know his preferences. Okay, looks like, looks like it is done. <laughs> I was debating just waiting until, to start the stream until it was, like, fully done. But I was like, well, that's a little, that's going to take a bit. 
So let's go ahead and we'll start playing the actual game instead of me just talking about coffee and suffering. So I, I have no idea what I'm doing going into this, so that's going to make it even more fun when the game wants to load. Eventually. Maybe. <laughs> Hello. It's taking a minute for this game for the game to load. I don't know if I'm, I did something wrong or if it's just oh up oh, there it goes. It, it it just took it just takes a minute. <laughs> I guess. All right, so we can we can't just continue our uh, our stream world, but I'm kind of interested just to like just start a new game and see if we can do the farming stuff from the get go. I don't know what new is, but we're gonna delete that. So we're gonna do a a new game, uh, farming test. Cause not, so now we're on a we're in a fresh game on a fresh world. Oh, there's people. The fuck is there people for? Can I talk to you? What the fuck would you say to me? All right. What about you? You want to talk to me? Oh. All right. All right, man. That makes sense. It's, there's a dude here. Looking for something. All right, I, th I saw they're adding NPCs, but I didn't know they're adding NPCs everywhere. Cool. Even like just random people, like this dude on the road. Blood. All right. Well, let's get in our big old stinky Tonka truck. And let's uh, drive over to the farming place. We, we probably still up. Uh... Oh, come on. You're going to get in the way of me as by ramping down this, aren't you? Well, hope you have health insurance. Um, y you all right there? Are you... Am I all right here, rather? <laughs> I'm stuck in a rock. Seriously? Are we just seriously stuck in like the just the wrong? We're st we're stuck. <laughs> I don't know if that's just me going really slow. It probably. Is. Oh hey, I mean I guess that's one way to get to Bridgeport. <laughs> uh, that wasn't uh, my intended way of getting here, but you know what? It's fine. There's a lot of NPCs around here now. I'm guessing every store has one. And there's probably more than that, even. There's, like, more than one there. Ooh, let's see what we got here. A hydro truck. MK2, MK2. Hydro roar, small, small, slow moving utility vehicle for flattening ground. Right mouse button lowers, raises roll. Okay, that's cool. And what is this? Hydro quad, fast four wheeler, which can carry a limited amount of items. Refueled from the water tank. Hmm, alright. So that's just for getting around more quickly, I guess. No. I already did. Joke's on you. Alright, well, let's, uh. I mean, I could have done all this on my good file that actually has, like, stuff on it, but I'm just kind of curious to see if we could do all this stuff with a very little startup. I'm guessing the answer's probably going to be no. Like, they probably expect you to play part of the game. Granga Field. Farming Guild. Alright. 
Well, let's, uh, I guess, see what everything is. Spend your tokens here. Birch seed, plant to a plant pot or trod ground to grow into a cosmetic plant. Okay, so those are, I guess, cosmetic plants. Sprinkle hook. Water hooks onto pipes and sprinkles water. Higher water pressure increases radius. Okay. Veg dicer hook. Chops vegetables when hooked onto a conveyor belt. Okay. Comp compresses cut vegetables. Can only store one type at a time. Requires water. Hmm. Okay. Okay, so these are the crop seeds. Exclusively stores vegetables in seed bags. Can be filled with four times water. Great for watering crops. Storage box for seeds. Plant pot. I haven't done anything yet. <laughs> okay, I mean, this looks well enough. It's a little plant. It's got an altar to the Dark Lord over here between the, between the farm buildings. What do we have here? Uh, the grocer, huh? What does that even mean? Good. Um, I'm guessing that's where you can sell veg veggies exclusively. Stove. Place, d place down to use. Heats up cooking pots. There's a scale. We've got... An empty soup bowl. Pour a cooking pot into the bowl to create some soup. Okay. It, ah, you can use this to... You can use your normal money, I think, to buy stuff here to get started. Cuts down crops. Digs and removes foundations for seeds to grow into crops. Cooking pot. A seed mill crushes vegetables to create seed bags depending on the vegetable size so that you don't have to make get your make your own seeds what about over here ah greenhouse stuff okay what is this farming utility vehicle harvest crops and replant seeds All right, that's pretty cool. It has eyes, it has forward facing eyes, which means it's a predator. <laughs> Makes sense. Right, got greenhouse stuff. I don't know if greenhouse actually. I mean, it's there's. I don't think there's an actual season, like actual seasons rather. Assuming that you um would um yeah well, let's um let's actually get on our actual file and come here and play now because I was just kind of checking this out real quick. We're doing we're doing stuff here at the new dig. I remember vaguely. Like we're trying to get some of this stuff kind of like going, and I think I did get it like making dirt, but I didn't really get much further than that. In part because I was wanting to wait for this update to come out, 
decided they wanted to play other stuff, and we have we have a little bit of money, so we could pro we could probably get away with um buying some farming stuff. Plus, they're actually really close to the the, the store place, so. Okay, I do. Add water, three vegetables, and heat to create soup. Well, I suppose, I suppose I'm probably supposed to buy one of those. I should probably buy one of these. Let's see, carrot seeds. I guess we're gonna only start growing carrots and tomatoes. <laughs> Just. I guess we'll just do like Digs and removes foundations for seeds to grow into crops. So we need one of these. Can I, can I put you in the pan? Yes. <laughs> Looks like we'll probably be doing this to carry all of our garbage. If it if it wants to f Oh the seed packs stack. Okay. I don't know if it really says how many we have. Thanks for your business. Oh, it does. You see the little orange dots. It means there's four carrot seeds there. We'll buy, we'll buy like five of each seed. You won't find better prices than these. <clears throat> yes. Thanks for all the bark lines. Great, it is cool they added NPCs. But maybe they should uh, be activated to talk to. <laughs> <coughs> okay, we have five of those. Seed mill. Yes. We got a pot cooking pot, some vegetables. Little diggy thingy. We've got the seed mill. We need a stove so we can cook vegan mental soup. Pour a cooking pot into the bowl. Alright, well, all this stuff's like two grand. That's just fucking nothing. Whoa, we just met. <laughs> <clears throat> Should have known better than to believe that would have worked. I got the goods if you got the cash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm leaving. <laughs> I guess it's also the case of how fast do these crops grow. I'm guessing we have to water them with a bucket first until we can get some of these uh, special coins. Alright, I think that's all we technically need to start the farming. I, I don't really know, but that's all the stuff at this shop, which seems to be like the gateway to get into the, into the new content. go buy one of those new vehicles I left all my money back over there didn't I yeah I did uh... <laughs> I gotta walk by the creepy lady again maybe I stand far enough away she won't notice me Well, my money's not in there. Well, that's silly. I'm silly. <laughs> 
Oh, I see. Now I see my money. Oh, there's just random dudes out and about. Alright. <clears throat> I wonder if they mean that or if that's just implying this stuff. Slow moving utility vehicle for flattening ground. I, this does sound useful. Everything seems a little laggier than I remember. Nope. Oh, I don't want to get. Can I just put my money here? Oh, no. <laughs> I was going to try to put my money on, like, the. On somewhere on this vehicle. Hmm. Well, that's awkward. I wish there was like a little basket to put some like some stuff in. Well, you're just off in the woods, aren't you? Hmm. Hey, <laughs> mm. That's probably why. It's been laggy. Because I neglected to do that, and there's probably just stuff building. There's probably just garbage building up back at the Ember Cradle's uh, industry space that was just constantly going. I forgot I need to do that at the, at the beginning of like every stream because, like, things. Like, when you stop and start the stream, things don't just, like, keep going like they were. They get a little gummed up, and it's not. Ideal. <clears throat> I was always like, wait, this is laggier than I remember. Don't mind me. I'm just mooching about. There might need to be a little bit more uh, variety in the dialogue. I mean, so far, this is a pretty cool vehicle, though. Well, I guess let's start trying to flatten some ground from here. Am I doing this wrong? seems to really be happening is um, nothing like it, it's, it's like getting stuck <laughs> well, well I was hoping it would help me like flatten this stuff out but it doesn't seem to be doing the, you have like a kaleidoscope that I'm not gonna look at because that could <laughs> that could trigger someone's um, sensory stuff <clears throat> I would assume that this roller needs to be down and then you could like flatten things, but I don't know if it's actually doing anything. Hmm. 
Um, surely it's not one. Surely it'd be doing less. Not like it's got a little horn. Am I supposed to just like tap the button to make it flatten things, or does that? Hmm. I wonder if this just doesn't work yet. Or maybe this is only a. Uh... Or maybe this doesn't flatten. Uh... Maybe this doesn't work on this dirt, it works on, like, stuff you dig. I don't know, but... Seems a little, like, false advertising for it to say it flattens terrain and then have it, like, not, you know, fun like, terrain like this, because, like, <laughs> just sliding down the hill. Um, yeah, that seems a little misleading. Might have to watch a video about this later on today, when I have time. But that's a little unfortunate. I'd rather have the vehicle I saw from older versions that like destroyed dirt than this that just doesn't seem to do anything. Eh, oh well. Anyway, I guess let's get this stuff out and kind of figure our figure our life out. I have a little stove there, I guess. And this is a little seed mill. Ah, it needs water. Okay, well. We do have water, but we'd have to connect, get a pipe off of there. And bring it over, which is fine. That's not like the end of the world. Uh, do we have any cross sections of pipes? I do remember we got this set up. One of the last streams. Wooden stairs. None. 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 None and none. Yeah, so this should be still working fine, all things considered. Um, I guess let's head down bottom and see if I have another one of those like those old t little T pipes floating around somewhere down here. I mean, if not, I'll just no, let's just get out of there. I'll just um, go buy one or something, I guess. Because these are all straights. Well, I guess that's our next mission after we clear out this is to go buy some more uh, some more pipes because I need a I specifically need at least a T pipe. Clunk. <laughs> a little bit of a, a disappointment for with the little roller machine because I saw that and I got excited thinking, oh, I could roll this all out and have it nice and flat and then uh, put like a garden there, but we're going to have to probably just garden over here <laughs> or something, I guess. I don't really know. I mean, this is a pretty new update. It's not even a week old yet, so maybe there's other patches planned for this to fix some things that people, um, I don't want to say complained about, but, like, things that people said, oh, hey, uh, this isn't how I exactly thought it was going to be. Is there any way you could change this? Because this is a free update. So you can't really be too mad because it just it just adds st stuff, you know. But I was I I got myself a little excited with the little roller truck here. I was like, oh hey, that, that's fun. And then it 
just doesn't see it doesn't seem like it worked either it doesn't work how I think it does or it's not working yet which both can be resolved by me either just learning how it works or by them doing a patch later or something either way it's not a big deal I've got other I got other things I gotta do to prepare this situation anyway like I need to buy uh, more pipe more pipe bits oh wait I already had money here whatever you won't find better prices than these I don't know in old in the olden days I could just steal things <laughs> what do these hats even do I can't remember hmm while holding it, left click on a crate to select it, and right click to clear the selected crate, then equip it and watch the magic. What does that even mean? I don't know what vague shit means. Just tell me what it does. Just tell me! Hmm. Alright, so I need a T pipe. I got the goods if you got the cash. Hello. <clears throat> Did they get rid of the little Wilhelm scream? I gotta know. No, they didn't. It just, I guess they patched the crate mod to um, not do the Wilhelm scream because it's not like stealing. Hmm. Interesting. Well. I already did, I already have. Uh, I guess we can investigate. I mean, I don't think, there, I can't imagine there's much more here. What's up? Alright, at least some of the NPCs have unique dialogue for what they are. You won't find better prices than these. Any new carts? Does not appear to be key. That's okay. I mean, they don't have to like have like new literally everything in the game. That, that seems a little. That's like a not really fair um, assessment when it's called a farming update. Not every single thing is going to pertain to farming. Do you have a speech bubble? Oh. Is that a speech bubble over your head? Not sure I'm hungry. Oh, they have quests. Six tomato stew. Hmm. By appointment of the crown, we have a fucking king. A contents are by weight, not quantity. Soup bowl, six cut tomatoes. Fetch me some scrum. The fuck does that mean? <laughs> I would assume that's like some slang for, for food or something. Considering I don't even have any tomatoes, it seems a little premature. <laughs> Anyway. Nope. I figure we can like offshoot some water 
this way. Do I literally only have this amount of pipes left? <laughs> hmm. Alright. I thought I had m many more pipes left over, but I guess I just really didn't buy that many. Yeah, it's fine. If I have to go buy more pipes, I'll just give me an excuse to go back to town, I guess. Yeah. It seems like, um, this, um, well, not... Oh, they changed how this thing looks. Can you can you not can you not activate it manually anymore? <clears throat> hmm. Huh? I mean, it's not like it was really working too well with no water attached to it anyway. But I was just like, hmm. There's not like a little lever on it anymore. I guess one fix that would be to go check out um, the cradle, but eh, maybe later. Right now, I still want to just kinda get this farming stuff going. So I guess this is what we're gonna do is just this sad excuse for furrows. Well, I am curious to see if that machine does run these over, so let's see if we can make a mess of this machine. So I guess that's fine, but that's not really what I expected the description of this um, machine to do. Like I was expecting it to just, like flatten out this flatten you know dirt but if its purpose is to like get rid of these then fair fair enough I guess wait what now it wants to work I mean that's fine I guess I wasn't I was, was I was I don't know I I now I look like an, a fool because it's actually working how I was ex how I would expect it to. Well, all right, I guess we can just flatten things out this way. Oh, <laughs> maybe not that enthusiastically. We probably do need to still go slow so we can. Uh... Do I need to, like, get some speed built up to flatten this out? I use this, the term speed very loosely. <laughs> oh, well, not note, I guess we probably need to move these kind of things out of the way since... seems like we might be able to flatten things with this after all. I just might have not been doing it right. <laughs> Big surprise. <laughs> Considering I didn't look at a tutorial or anything for any of this. You know, just kind of <laughs> throwing caution in the wind. I was like, oh, well maybe it flattens these. and it, No, it does not, but it does seem to actually work on this dirt in some way. I don't really understand yet so but I guess what we can do is we can go like flatten it in stages maybe hmm I don't know why it wasn't working before but it seems like it's definitely working now
this, <laughs> this thing's a bit of a mess. It'd probably be more worth my time to, to kind of chop this hill down first. Which, I think we definitely have a pickaxe that can help us do that. Because flattening this entire thing might be interesting, but it probably take a while to actually get it to do what we want to do. So, let's see. I know we have... A bunch of torches, apparently. What is this? Oh, this is the onyx pick. That That's just what the doctor ordered. Apparently, this doctor loves dirt. I mean, doctors like weird shit. Like, after working with doctors again, like, they're all just, they're all really bizarre, like, out of touch people. <laughs> It's like the rich arist it's like the rich aristocrats from like olden times that would like sponsor an artist except these people just hate you and want impossible things. I mean not all of them, but a, a, a non zero amount of them are just like like fucking weirdos compared compared to me, a fucking weirdo. So it's like mm. Uh, I guess let's just kind of try to soften up some of this dirt area here with this pick, and then we can flatten it out a little bit, or try to flatten it out. I can't imagine it would add more dirt to places that are lower than it, but... Alright, let's 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 see what things look like now that we kind of took that o OP pickaxe to it. It's not even the most OP pickaxe from that mod. Oh, we're sliding. No, no. Yeah, they're 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 just there. Ah, okay, so that's how you can do it. If like you get stopped you can like lift the thing and then like put it down again to kind of maybe get some more uh, juice out of it. I don't know how I managed to make free floating dirt with something that flat <laughs> flattens things out, but I managed. I did it. Are you proud of me? <laughs> I mean, this thing definitely flattens some dirt out, but, like, it already kind of be, needs to be mostly flat anyway for it to be super effective. Because if it's, there's a, if there's too big of, like, a, the, <laughs> and that dip there, yeah, that's not gonna, we'll probably have to use a rake to get the dirt back for that, in that case, but. I will say, this beats using a rake, even if it's not perfect. Oh, oh, 
Oh, oh god. I think we're stuck. <laughs> Do I have enough torque to back up? No. No, there's not. There's not. Okay, we got out. <laughs> Maybe. Have we have we truly escaped the hell void or the hell slope? It seems like we have uh, in fact not done that. Am I gonna have to unstuck because I'm stuck in dirt that I'm supposed to be flattening? <laughs> you know what? Fair get fair play. Just gotta get good at flattening dirt, I guess. kind of just like wiggle the head around to kind of flatten some stuff while you're going real slow I guess hmm I guess this gardening thing technically gives you stuff to do with the top part of your your mo your claims instead of just having I'm building like a really like kind of craptastic house. I mean, it's fine. The housing's fine, but like it's not like this is like a house building game, so like your mileage will greatly vary based on your amusement with how the houses look or whatever. So I don't I don't want to say oh the house the house building sucks crap game cuz no that's not the it's also not the main point of the game so it's you know <laughs> I'd be a, I'd be a little silly and um not really fair to the game to have that as like my take on it cuz it's it's not a house building game like if it was the, if it was a Sims game and the building was like this, yeah, probably let's maybe have a bit of a more negative opinion of it, but but this is most certainly not a house building game. <laughs> now that this thing's actually working how I was expecting it to, which is you know actually flattening terrain. I think this was definitely worth a lot worth more worth my money than I was expecting. This vehicle, not the game, by the way, because I, I paid like 15, 20 bucks for the game and I've gotten plenty of mileage out of it. If, if that's the metric you want to do like a game's worth of like hours played versus price, then this game is definitely a good one. If you want to do that kind of like, like capitalist vulture fucking mentality there. I'm trying to understand some people are forced to do that because they have so little time to consume games or enjoy things rather than like not consume <laughs> consume game all right well let's see if I can ramp up here to get back up to this mmm maybe ah, flatten it fine flatten it whatever Alright, well, it looks like the rest of that area might just have to be pickaxed. So, let's, uh... We can't even jump up there. So, let's, uh, do so, I guess. Maybe a slightly smaller pickaxe is in, or is in order for this. It seems like it might be more delicate work. Anyway, in the meantime, we should probably plant these seeds. Since the fur... Well... Let's make different furrows, because some of these are, like, floating now. <laughs> okay, that doesn't count as real dirt. Is this? No, it's still, like, the edge of the plot. Uh, I guess the right question is, do I actually have a rake here? I do.
Hmm. I guess that's one way to do it, but yeah, I don't. I'm not a big fan of the rake. It seems like a, it's a little. Um, Let's grab our other pickaxe, this uh, shard one, which is a, a little less OP. Still plenty good, but for the purpose that I'm trying to do here, it's probably a better pick. Here I was thinking about progressing to the scrap pick, the, like the, the super mega pickaxe that would like literally move all the dirt. That doesn't seem like it'd be a good idea now with um, this. Like without how you have to have like dirt for your farms or whatever. Then again, I could always um, just add dirt back in manually, like on top of like concrete or something, but. In the end, this is supposed to be like a chill, just relaxing, relaxing game. There's sh you shouldn't really worry as much about min-maxing or whatever. Even though that's kind of how my brain thinks sometimes. It's like, how can you get the maximum stuff out of minimum amount of things? Oh no, I just like being frugal if possible, I guess. Then again, that could also just be a side effect of living in capitalism. <laughs> you know. Yeah, there's, it's unavoidable to have to like kind of think that way sometimes about things even if you don't want to I don't know no, Jesus Christ there's a lot more dirt than I was expecting this to be This is gonna. This was probably gonna have to happen either way at some point, either by me using the claim destroyer, or by uh, use, just using other pickaxes. But Come on, game. Be humble. Okay. <laughs> I was afraid to decide I wanted to crash. So I've, I have had this game crash like once or twice before. Which isn't necessarily a sign of like a bad game because, you know, sometimes things happen. Sometimes games, games are not easy to make. Like, I'm not a programmer in the slightest, but I know for a fact that stuff's not easy to, to make it run on a good day. All right, let's 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 try let's try doing some more flattening with the old with our new toy. <clears throat> For that though, I'm just gonna furrow out some sp spots right here. And plant these seeds and see if that, see how that works. <clears throat> and I'm suspecting um, that 
We like to water these, of course. <clears throat> right now, our best pro part. Can we pour? I can't. We. <clears throat> We need to get another, at least another, um, pipe or two over here. Get this water into a more use, usable area. Because right now, that's a little, uh, not useful. Or usable, rather. Both. <laughs> it's both. <clears throat> so, my original thought process with this claim was going to be... Uh, basically, um, oh, the top part's undeveloped, because who cares? But now there's stuff, there's, you know, farming stuff you can do on the top part. All right, where was that pipe at? There we go. I need to restock on pipes. I don't know if I placed it in the right spot. And then we can just take this to the store. Huh? Huh? Come on. Huh? Put in the put in the damn truck up. Oh. It kind of flopped over and submitted rather easily, so I was like, hmm. That seems a little suspicious. Ooh, can I actually just go to this this store to buy rebuy stuff? I should probably split off some money just to keep at this store. Not huh? you! Go over there. <laughs> This can go to the store over here with me. <clears throat> I only accept guild tokens. All right, fine, whatever. No, leave me alone, please. So I can come here, if I put one item in th this crate, I can then buy nine more at this store that's like really close to the claim. So I don't even like really need to take the truck. It's much closer than Bridgeport. And I, I need more pipes, so I was, it's worth my time to do so. Alright, because I need to get this water further over this way. Right now, that water was mainly designed for going down there, but, like, I obviously need it now, too. Nope, oh, that's... That's wrong thing. Take that back, thank you. You take that back! <laughs> Why don't I just move you uh, over here out of the way? Yeah. Huh? Huh? 
as long as I leave one pipe in there, I can just go buy more if it really comes to it. Which it might, because, like, yeah. My hope is that I'll be able to like, I mean these are kind of, oh I see they do get dry. Well it's a good thing I was kind of trying to get this going and get some. That does work, but oh that's going to be labor intensive. Uh, it still only affects. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I think one of the first things I buy is probably going to be a watering can in that case, because this is um, giving me flashbacks to early game. Let's actually build a little path kind of over here because eventually I probably would be doing this anyway, but I kind of want to now, especially if I'm going to be like climbing around this area because as fun as it is just doing those like death defying jumps, <laughs> um, I'm liable to fall at some point and that's just going to waste time. So let's uh, make a little path over here. I wonder, can you just pour, can you pour the pot? Can you use the pot as like water? Probably not. No. I mean, it's gonna eventually need water anyway. <coughs> Excuse me. Now where did that bucket go? What's up here? Yeah, water watering more than one crop with great right, so that that makes it easier. And again, I could always just like get some pipe over here to make this process less painful. I probably should. Build more pipe over here. kind of just <laughs> just kind of going with this I'm not really planning anything specific with this. I'm just like mm, I need this to happen you know I just need this to work and I guess before I went before I head off gallivanting around I probably should water these I don't know how long this takes to grow I can imagine if these are watered constantly they probably grow a little faster I 
Yeah, I might be looking into getting uh, sprinklers. Like, I don't, I don't know how much stuff we get from any of this, any of this process. Yeah, that's my current solution to um, the watering problem. <clears throat> Another solution would be just have the uh, have a have pipes dripping over every single one of these, but I don't know how that works as opposed to uh, just doing this. It's like one glob of water seems like it can only affect one plant. Like if I put it like here, it probably only hit one of them. Yeah, hit that one. Instead of hitting both of them, it seems it's probably just. I don't know if it just picks one or what it does. <clears throat> like, let's put it in the middle here. Okay, it doesn't pick one. It, I think it like prioritizes the one to the right of wherever you're pouring it. So it's probably just better to pour directly onto it with your bucket. All right. Well, those are kind of those are watered for what it's worth. So those will be at least fine until I go buy more pipes. <clears throat> And I've got so much money, I might as well just go buy like a bunch of pipes at once. Like, I bought—I was buying stuff like this in like smaller increments because, well, that's just lot. And with these other crates, where's all my little pipes go? It's not there. Where did I put that crate? It was literally right here, wasn't it? Floor, wooden stairs, T pipe. No, oh, it's right here. Well, yeah, we're gonna just uh, do this because I can't be bothered to. Like these pipes are gonna be, but it's a big. It's gonna be a little pricey buying max of these, but pricey is not really a problem right now because I thought I think of like two million hydro coins or something, something silly like that. I didn't want to talk to you. Oh, maybe. Maybe not that many pipes. Actually, no, let's screw it. Do I have enough money for that? No, I don't. Okay, we can we can just uh like right click max to move all. All right, well I'll buy a hundred right now, and now that should be enough pipes to kind of do what we need to do or what we want to do rather. Which for now is to uh, get water closer to these plants. Yeah, they're already starting to get parched again, needy bastards. <laughs> and what I will do is I will go buy 10 more of these elbows, because you need a lot less elbows usually than you do other, uh, with the normal pipes, so... I don't mind buying only 10 of these at a time. You need a lot more of these straight pipes than these uh, elbows, on average. Unless you're doing like, like specific things like the little system I have over there. 
Actually, no, that, that doesn't even use these pipes. It uses some other stuff, so... I, in fact, do have the cash. <laughs> you kind of eerie looking lady. I would assume probably the first thing you want to do is get a sprinkler. Like, immediately. Well, probably a watering can and then a sprinkler, because if you have this kind of drip situation, like, over here, then you can just have a watering can that you um, fill up with water. I wish there was, like, a water tank sort of, like, kind of structure that you could fill things up with, like, say it was, like, a water tank that's connected with, like, one of these pipes and it fills up with, like, water based on like the water pressure and then like say you're holding like a bucket and you like left click the faucet and fill that bucket with water I feel like that'd be a good a good mod or a good thing to have but anyway I don't know if I've ever gone over my, like, my, I guess, quote-unquote streaming slash VTuber philosophy or whatever. I don't know if that's even a thing. I'm, I'm probably just t saying weird shit. But I guess my philosophy would be do what feels right, do what's fun, or don't do it at all. Because, like, if I'm not having a good time, what the hell am I even doing with my life? Well, with my time as streaming, because, yeah... I, I've gone over it on my Twitter, actually, last night while I was laying in bed. <laughs> but, like, I don't have an especially large amount of time to spend on things. So, I tend to, um, try to do as much as I can with what I've got. And that definitely includes, the, like, uh, v being a VTuber and being like a streamer in general, you know, that kind of stuff. Now, I will see if I, I will see if I can just like have these pipes come like over and land on the plants themselves and maybe that'll work, but I have a feeling it's not going to water all of them. But it's worth a shot because if I can get at least get these kind of automated, then. They should, they should grow up nice, big and strong. But I'm, yeah, I'm imagining this isn't gonna cut it. <laughs> Water's inching ever, ever closer. Yeah, it, it, it doesn't, uh, it'll, it would only, uh, do like maybe if these were the same kind of crop it would uh, work that way and if I had a whole bunch of them in the same row it probably would work fine like that but let me see I think I have some uh, T pipes over here I can I can test that out because that would be a kind of a a cheesy way to have uh, sprinklers before you even have, you know, sprinklers. Before you uh, have, like, um, hydrated stuff before you even have, um... You, you know what I'm saying, right? Ah, okay, that's, um, needs to go one more over. Okay, so that technically would work. Kind of. A 
whole tomato. <laughs> Just throw it on the ground. So does this like, do these like keep growing tomatoes or is it only is it like one and done? This is not an not an ideal setup, I'll tell you that. It does kind of work though for like these. But yeah, we're st we're still um <laughs> just just throwing tomatoes on the ground. Um Now we could try to cheese this further with the carrots too. Yeah, never mind. That's not gonna work because the carrots are too close to the. Uh... I didn't really think too hard about that. That's okay. I'll just kind of add a little bit here that I can just kind of. Use for the bucket. Hmm. Now we cooperate. I mean, it counts, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> bad morning, everyone. Well, ba ba bad morning to you, too. <laughs> how, you, how you doing? I, I'm imagining not, you know, stellar because of, you know. Yeah, but tell me about it if you want to. We're, we're dealing with the new farming expansion. For, uh, well, not really expansion, it's just like a patch that adds farming stuff. I'm slowly but surely just making a, a mound of tomatoes on the ground over here, because I guess tomatoes regrow, but carrots do not. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'll, I'll tell you one thing. That's like the thing I don't miss about living in apartments is like the neighbors being literally right there and doing like the weirdest shit at like... The worst times, it feels like. Perfect for a snowman nose. Fuck you. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they didn't expect the carrots to be uh, re uh, pickable, because in real life, I don't think that's how it works. But yeah, there's just like a little carrot tube, a little carrot in there, and then you pull it out, and it's just there. So, it's, so it seems like these to, these tomato well it seems like all the crops so far will uh, just kind of re endlessly regrow once you plant them. Uh, can I can I put these tomatoes in one of our normal like basins here? I, I kind of slept a little rough myself too, admittedly. Can I just? Okay, they do, it does it does work like this.
Well, I've got five carrots and five spots, so that means all these must have... Wait, did that one have more than one? Sleepy siblings, yay! <laughs> Wait, am I like... Did I like accidentally just dupe carrots? Or, or are there, are there mo Oh no, there's probably mo more than one per uh, sp spot, I guess. Hmm. Um, Alright, I mean, cool. Carrots! That one's got like three in there. Damn. Calm down. <laughs> I guess we could make like some soup. I don't know if that's like worth anything. But we can do it. It's probably gonna be. He's, come back! <laughs> there it goes! It's, it's got somewhere to be. I, I understand. Alright. <laughs> it's still going! Get in the fucking pot. Alright. Listen, you gonna keep rolling forever? Okay, you finally ran out of like an inertia or whatever. <laughs> I'm. This is all just. I've. I've not tested this expansion slash like p patch before now. So like all of this is just like live. It's live footage of me just goofing off with the stuff because I don't really know what to do with it. And I need this so I can have enough height to climb on top of here to put carrots in the pot. Or do I have to cut them up? I There's precious little I know about how to actually process the, the vegetables. I know there's like a conveyor belt attachment thing that chops vegetables, but I don't know if like you can just like take the saw and like cut carrots with the saw. <laughs> I'm guessing the answer to that is no. I mentioned the tomatoes are probably gonna regrow their stuff because I mean the carrots were uh, very enthusiastically growing. But I don't know how long that takes. Or maybe they only regrow so many. I, d I don't really know. And if that's the case, let's um, keep a few of these tomatoes. Like, we'll keep five of the tomatoes. In case I need to turn them to seeds. Same with the uh, carrots, because I don't know like how... The growing works with them. I don't know if they'll just keep regrowing forever, if there's like a certain amount or what. It's all very new. Like this update's less than a week old, so it's hard to really tell how things work unless like you experiment with firsthand, which is fine. I mean, that's kind of like one of the more that's what kind of one of the nicer things about games like this having updates like this is that well. Sometimes you just get to have to experiment because there's just no info yet. Or maybe there is info yet and I'm just being stubborn. It, it, it's about a 50-50 there. Let's... Alright, so we got that stuff. The way this like really janky watering setup works is that these 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 tomatoes are probably watered, but the carrots will eventually be dry, and I don't know if they'll regrow. But in the event that they do not, we have uh, saved back some, and we have this um, where is it? Like seed mill somewhere. This guy crushes vegetables to create seed bags depending on the vegetable size. And when they say vegetable size, that makes me real. That makes me think that there's um, gonna be um, fertilizer or something that I need to contend with. But 
for now, let's just uh, run these over to the new place. An old farming guild place over here that's conveniently right next to my build. Part, another reason to do a South Hope is that this farming place is like right next to it too, so. It's like another like tally mark in favor of um, South Hope. And this place sells stuff that'll help um, This, this place sells stuff that lets you, um, do more, better farming. Like, this has, like, sprinkler stuff and a, a veggie dicer. I have a feeling there's not any other, any way to, um... I got a feeling there's not any other way to cut vegetables other than, uh... Yeah, you can't. You have to think. You have to sell things at the grocer. But I think there's no other way to cut vegetables other than a conveyor belt. It seems like. <laughs> yeah, like this just alter to like the Dark Lord in between the little farm building stuff. No, oh, you have a quest. Great, happy for you. You're a farmer, right? Just grow it. Oh, lad. oh, they also have these, like, kind of awkward NPCs. Spend your tokens. How, how do I get tokens? That says C, as opposed to, like... Huh? Like, that's probably gonna give me Hydra... Yeah, that just gets me Hydra coins. That, I don't... That's not useful to me. If I want hydro coins, I have a little mining setup that does that. No, stop. Don't talk to me, weird. Awkward NPC. Like, they really should have not had a proximity-based uh, talking thing. Yeah, th this whole area is, is brand new. Like, this area was here, but it was, like, all, like, it wasn't, like, all set up, and it was, like, bo like kind of boarded off or whatever. So the NPCs are brand new. There's NPCs everywhere. What does this guy do? I reckon bridge bore one million before Fombrick got here. What does that even mean? I don't speak British. <laughs> I don't speak British. <laughs> I'm just confused because how do I get these guild tokens? Like, spend your tokens here, but how do I get the tokens? <laughs> just cry, break my, break my bones. I got the goods if you got the cash. It cuts down crops, which great. That's cool. Um, let's look at this. So you want do you want four t four tomatoes in a bowl? Sure well, all right, I guess. Well, I guess we can test that out now because I've got I've got some tomatoes here. I don't know if I have four. Oh, I I do have four. Okay, well, I guess it's by a bowl. Give me a, give me a bowl. Can I just put tomatoes in the bowl, or do I have to like do something with it? I'm gonna assume I have to like do something with it. But what do I do with it? Is the question. Can I put the bowl in there? Can I just put everything in here? All right, the bowl didn't seem like it fit very well. Although it's definitely in there. Yeah, you know, whatever, fine. Um, I only accept guild tokens. Yeah, that's great. Happy for you. Um, Cause it says there's like a veg dicer, which means there should be a way to manually chop vegetables. But I don't 
know what that is. Is there oh my good Probably would be nice to use my fucking eyes. <laughs> there. Well cool. Now we can do the thing I was just bitching about. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna cut we're gonna cut these tomatoes in the dirt. A little dirt never hurt, you know? You know the saying. Mmm <laughs> Tomato slices in the dirt, my favorite. Oh, it's gotta be a soup. Fuck me. Well. Alright, can I carry can I carry the knife too? Nope. Alright, cool. Good talk. <laughs> well, and now I at least I can't believe I missed that knife. Granted. I'm doing all this without looking at like any sort of help or info or anything, so I'll, I'll try to be a little bit more lenient, but yeah, that's a, a bit of a goof on my part. Alright, well, into the soup you go. What's gonna let me add all the vegamadobles? Okay, so that should be all for the tomatoes. Of them tomatoes. All right, well here's uh, some. Uh... I. Okay, this is a different one for a six-cut tomato. From some dude that was like over there. Well, I guess let's run this soup bowl back to this guy that was over there. This is more than four, but I don't know. I doesn't seem like there's like a. I had four tomatoes and they cut it and turned it to five point eight. I don't know how that math works, but you know, I mean, I, I was never that great at math, so <laughs> we'll just um. Is this what you want? You want you want this? You want this? You want you want the soup? Mmm. Put it in your belly. I'll, I'll help. I'll help you. See? Well, that's not really your belly, but you know what? Enjoy. I don't fucking know what. The... <clears throat> you can do some scrum. Yes. There's whatever the hell scran is is here. Do you want this? Uh, there's British people everywhere! <laughs> this is... Does it have to be exactly four? Because if so, that's fucking obnoxious. Because this is like... I got more soup for you! Extra more soup! Well, I guess we're gonna have to either wait for more tomatoes to grow and try again. Or something. Can I put the soup back? Can I put this back in the pot? Nope, it's just. It exists on this moral plane as a failed soup. Good talk. Uh, well. Either they take a while, or they're, these plants are, like, all planted out. Can I remove the thingies? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, well, <laughs> let's let's see if this works. Why is this? Why'd that one go there? What in tarnation? Oh. 
That's probably my fault for just being lousy at digging holes. Alright, that should work, right? I think, right? Anyway, uh... Now I gotta figure out how I'm gonna do this monstrosity. I could just make it pipe come down. Probably should just do that. Uh, let's just straight pipes, some elbows. Well, let's... I guess in this case, let's get, grab an elbow! And, uh, yeah. Just grab your elbow and make it work. Alright, uh, where was that thing at? I was just looking at it. Where did I put it? How did I manage to lose the thing that was literally right in front of my eyes? Not you. How? Oh, hey, there's a carrot. <laughs> Just a wayward carrot. You know what? Oh, so I have the five there still, so this is just extra carrot. There you go. Into the carrot box with you. Hmm. No, just get out of the way. <laughs> well, that does seem to be working. Let's see. I just. Oh, that gave me two seeds. Well, alright. I guess for now we're gonna just get some concrete floor and try to make this look presentable. So I can more easily do things. Uh, well. Maybe I need to have this a little higher up. So I can drop them in like I'm kicking a virgin into a volcano. <laughs> Which is very rude stereotype. Or just like kick, I don't know. Just, let's just get the seeds in there, so. I can't really count very easily, cause I, okay, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, Okay, so that's eight seeds. Although I could have swore those were giving me two each and I put five in, but maybe I just didn't count correctly. Either way, that's more than I bargained for because I was expecting these to only give me one seed. So I guess let's chew up another carrot and then we'll have carrot seeds and I won't have to worry about buying anymore. I mean, a number somewhere, like, a, a little, like, ten next to the carrot would be, um, nice. Because, I mean, I get the whole, a lot of the, a lot of the, the appeal of this game is, like, it's very, it's very, it's very non-huddy. Like, there's not, like, HUDs for everything everywhere that are, like, obvious. But, sometimes numbers are nice to be able to read. <laughs> anyway. Not, on that note, it looks like we're going to get 10 tomato seeds out of all these, so we'll be able to... For starters, get out of the hole. You've been evicted.
Wait, that didn't give me as many seeds as I thought I was gonna get. Four, five, six. That gave me like seven. What? Hmm. Well, that's um, awkward. Oh, well, I guess we're planting these and then I'll plant carrots or something. Maybe I should have just um, chop, chopped them up one at a time. I, I don't really know the how the math of that worked out, but... Alright, cool. Well, that's happening, I guess. I guess we'll see if this really hydrates all of them, because... It's kind of hard to really... Anyway, you can drive this thing around. At the start of the stream, I bought like this one. Of the first thing I bought, and it wasn't didn't seem like it was working, but I did eventually get it to where it was working. And it's like a it like flattens terrain. We'll see how well it does with this area. I've kind of like been chopping away at. Kind of wiggle my nose around. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Just like hugging the curve here to kind of chew away at stuff that I'm probably not meant to be able to flatten with this. Play around with this while the the crops grow. As with all the vehicles, this runs on water, and it looks like it's looking a little, uh, it's getting a little dry. I'm largely just making a mess, <laughs> it looks like, but you know what, it's fine. So at least it's a fun mess. Like, like there's just like this earth this orb of earth just floating in the air that's not even affected by this anymore because of the height Wee! bonk 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 <laughs> Enough of that. Let's uh, 
investigate our plants here, see if they're actually being hydrated. Some of them are, but some of them aren't. It's kind of a weird stipulation of them not. Also, can't really see because of the freaking shadows. What in the hell? What happened there? <laughs> Yeah, it seems like this doesn't, it's not a foolproof way to auto water your stuff, unless you like space your plants out specifically, which I probably could have done, which probably would have been smart, but you know. This is me we're talking about, it's kind of a 50-50 there, if that's going to make actually work or not. Yeah, having them planted so close together is probably not ideal. Probably. Those are still kind of growing. Now, if we could flatten stuff to this height, that make it, it it means it would be flattened to the degree that the rake flattens it, which means it would be equal. Which seems like it'd be more ideal than whatever I have going on right now, which is not exactly flat, but kind of flat, like... Hmm. Ring around the rosy, pocket full of posies. All right, I think we got stuck. <laughs> Do I get stuck on something else now? I... Wow. <laughs> I think I got stuck on like part of the wall. There we go, I shouldn't be stuck now. I think you're meant to be going slow in doing this instead of like ramp, like driving around like a speed demon. Oh, where's the fun in that? It's fun going fast. Well, comparatively, there's only so fast, so fast you can really go with something that moves as slow as molasses. As slow as molasses, you know. Those molasses are a little slow.
Well, all things considered, this growing situation is not half bad. But once I figure out this hydro coin, not hydro coin, these of uh, this, I don't know the the method between the mad behind the madness of the um, vegetable chopping. I don't know if like. There's a way to... Oh, I bet there is a freaking way to tell... Like... There is a scale that this lady sells, so that's probably a clue that I need to, um... Cut vegetables and kind of, like, separate them out into, like, equitable, uh, piles. They should not trust me with this cooking knife. I'll, I'll chop things that aren't meant to be chopped. Like all this foliage. The sign. Can I mash piles of vegetables together? You can, okay. Let's see, how much carrot is this? 4.5? Well, let's... And you can split them. 2.6. Oh god damn it, I have to do math. One point one three. I don't wanna do I don't wanna do carrot math. Whatever, you just big big sloppy pile of carrots, I guess. our carrot pile there I'm gonna look up these uh, villager job things, cause like. No, Google, I don't want you to know my location. Everything I'm searching is for like, I'm searching Hydroneer villager jobs, and the only thing it's pulling up is fucking Minecraft. Hmm. Maybe I should search uh, Hydroneer Farming Update. Hmm. Hmm. Well, that doesn't help much. Like, without watching a video, I'm probably not. Well, let's, uh, look at... The patch notes, I guess. Filled with lots of stores, blah, blah, blah.
Hmm. Well, all right, great. Can't really find any info. I mean, that's kind of the the deal with these in, with indie games like this. Hey, this one like. This, uh, soup bowl. Let's take this soup bowl back to this dude. Maybe we can figure it out. Like, I was just got a little annoyed at him because I was like, I have soup for you. You wanted soup, right? And he, he just kind of, like, looked at me and started just like, I want some scran. It's like, shut up. You're British. Why is everyone British? <clears throat> like, let's see what this says. Soup bowl. Requirement, four cut tomato. I think this is the guy that wanted it, right? Fetch me some I mean, it's def it's more than that, unfortunately. Oh! Thanks, I'm well chuffed. Okay, you have to drop it on him. And you get the bowl back at least, but like. Alright, well, cool. Oh, we can actually afford a watering can. So, we're buying that immediately. Take a look at my goods. No, I don't want to. <laughs> I wish they would have explained anywhere on how you actually turn in the quest, because, like, he, he asked for a bowl of soup that was, uh, had a weight of, like, four, and that was, like, more than that. Now that we have, um, now we have... words now that we have the watering can we should be able to um make this process a little less tedious Oh, you have to aim it to, like... I thought I had four water in. Whatever. So... Oh! So if you're getting drops like that, each drop is a separate uh, entity that has to enter the can. Okay, I got it now. This is a, a bit of a shit show, I'll be completely honest, because, well, I'm just, like, learning how things work for this. Am I... Do I even have a cart over here? I probably don't. I probably should go buy one for 
or bring one over from somewhere. Currently, they don't seem interested in carrot soup, but we have carrots. Not grief for a snowman knows. Oh, come on. Where's your sense of adventure? I guess this is the carrot rock now. There you go. Enjoy the carrots. This is our little soup station. It doesn't seem like these uh, produce uh, stuff forever. Like they produce like one or two pickings or so of stuff. And that's about it. That's okay because we can turn some of these back into, um, into seeds. And then we can just grow like nothing. Oh, there's a bunch of carrots in here it looks like. So we can have more carrots that we don't use. <laughs> Let's have a carrot, the carrot army over here. So it's not always two seeds per veg vegetable. So that is seven. That's nine, because I think I think each uh, area has, yeah, each seed bag looks like it has space for, uh, okay, each, each seed bag can hold ten. All right, good to know. So we have that there, and this is an extra seed, so the rest of these can be uh, chopped up and um, made to soup bowls for quests or whatever, so let's just uh, pour them out and... Mmm, where's our little choppy knife? Uh, there's, a, there's, a, there's a person on YouTube I watch, like, play some silly stuff. Things like Let's Game Out or whatever, and, like, he play, he's done some obscene things to this poor game. So I'm just like, I can't wait to see what he does with all the farming stuff to fucking break it in half. So we got enough replacement seeds, and I might even get a few more tomatoes out of it anyway, but like... Oh, the, the, collect, the tomato collective. How many tomato we have? 10.7... Now, did I, did I have another bowl somewhere, or did that guy like slurp it up? It's like, mmm, that's good, next. <laughs> I think he did. You know what, we're gonna go buy, we're gonna go buy a cart. For this area because yeah I don't have a cart for just over here which is a uh, bad idea hey, blood. No, I don't want to. You're scared. You're scared. You're scaring me. Free me! I just want to. I just want to exchange money for goods and services. No, <laughs> help! Your 
business. No. Don't talk to me. Please. No, please. Don't take what's a little is left of my soul. <laughs> uh. Okay. So this is a uh, 10.7, and we can split up this further. It should be like seven or something. That's eight. Probably that means this is probably six, which is just over what this wants for a. Uh, Now, can I use the watering can to add water to the soup? You to you, you you totally can. <laughs> All right. Well, <laughs> just got like piles of tomato bits everywhere. Should be like around like four or so. Almost five, actually. Okay. So I guess that's kind of funny, you can just, you can use, um... <laughs> you can use, you can use a watering can to fill up, um, this kind of situation. Oh, now you want to, now you want to contribute. Hydrate, hydrate. All right, sweet. I've got some coffee left over, and then I'll chase it with some of this bottled water I have from work. I'll have you know I've been hydrating these plants very thoroughly. <laughs> Look, they're hydrated. I will, I will, I will hydrate through vicariously through them. <laughs> No, but I just finished my coffee and I'll drink some water. Mmm, thank you. Thank you. Alright, so those are... I think these plants are very, um, not alive anymore. Like, they're alive, but they're not producing anything else. At least I, th I still don't think they're gonna produce anything else, so we're gonna have to go get, like, a scythe or something to, um... To cut them down. Actually, no, we're not going to do that, because we can, um, where's our little trowel at? Is it over here? Yeah, we can, uh, just, um, do this to destroy them. See, I had, the, I had the genius idea of until I get sprinkles, I can just do something like this, and if it's landing on just that plant, it should hydrate it, I would imagine. <clears throat> With that thought process, I could just do uh, something like this. I need more uh, T pipes, but you can probably see what I'm going with here, because we can't afford a sprinkler system yet. 
Because you have to use those uh, guild tokens to do that. Uh, so let's take this to the back to the uh, that store. We're gonna want to pick up any bowls or anything we left there anyway, so we'll just uh, go over to the store, fill this up with more tea pipes and all that, and pick up any bowls or whatever. Cause it seems like the people like give you the bowl back as soon as they just eat the food. They just eat it immediately. <laughs> So I got a bowl here that I bought and was trying to like mess with to figure things out. I'll probably buy another bowl. No, please stop. Don't talk to me. I do not wish to be perceived by this. What are you looking at? I got the goods if you got the cash. I, I'm concerned of what you're looking at. I just noticed you're looking like up at some, well maybe not up, but like it looks like they're like staring into the sky waiting for like a meteor or something to come down. I'm just like, oh God. <laughs> I think there was a bowl over here too. That, yeah, this this dude's like, mmm, delicious. You want more? I mean, all right, cool, I guess. He's like, I need more tomato. Give me the tomato. Which, more? You want more? <laughs> Fucking Oliver Twist. <laughs> like that really old Oliver Twist movie where they're like, more? You want more? <laughs> God, that's terrible. <laughs> anyway, I think we got. Wait, uh, all right. Olympic sprint back to the shop to pick up my crate that I didn't put on the cart. Uh, I, I was too, I was too enraptured by the freaking re repressed memory of the Oliver Twist movie. <laughs> It's just always like in the background of my stupid little poison brain, just like, because it's like it's Im immensely British how they try to sound in that movie, and all these people sound British because of course they do. If there's not, if I can't grow beans, I'm gonna be upset with this game. I'd be like, why can't I grow beans? If they're British. They want beans. I mean, that's 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 how things work, right? They, they're British people. They like beans. I would assume. Beans, beans on toast. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right. <laughs> Like it's it's not re this isn't realistic. This isn't a this isn't a life simulator anymore. If there's not beans on toast, <laughs> I know we need another uh, another tea pipe. Uh, yeah, I bleh, words. I think you can see where I'm going with this. Yep. Alright, so I need another elbow to kind of make that go down. I think once we get a sprinkler, we can have like a much nicer looking kind of situation here. Let's make the time go back a little bit more so I can, uh...
have stuff not have the shadows not covering everything. All right, so we have like we have ten tomato seeds here. We're gonna plant all these and. There seems to be an, 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 an inordinately high demand for tomatoes in this little town. How many How many tomato is this? Four? How many tomato does this one want? This one wants six, so we can't do this one yet. And I think this one wants like eight. This one's like really hungry for tomatoes. Once these grow, I'm really curious to see if we can just like cut the tomatoes that are still uh, when they're still on the vine. <laughs> that sounds silly, and I'm here for it. It's like, mmm, slice tomatoes right off the vine. <laughs> I'll probably end up like during lunch or whatever. I'll probably try to like watch a video about like this and. Cause I saw like a video title, it's like, watering plants without sprinklers. Like, yeah, you're probably doing this, I imagine. I would have done this sooner if I, my brain wanted, if my third eye would have opened sooner of like, wow, if I could just have the water drop land right where, you know, this is, they'll, they'll probably make them hydrated, you know? Like, yeah. <laughs> Fucking... Big fucking brain right there. Oh, speaking of, hi. Wait, what? What soup is this? How much soup are you? Well, I have balls now. Mmm, delicious. Okay. This is six, like almost exactly. So whatever one that had needed six, uh, this one. I'm, I'm assuming that this will. Um, th I, I think this guy was in Bridgeport, but I'm assuming this like contract will disappear once he gets this. Once he devours his tomato soup. I've yet to see, I have, well, I've only had like three quests total so far, but I've yet to see anyone want anything but tomato soup, so they really love their, uh, their New World, uh, delicacies here in New Britannia or whatever the fuck. I don't know what Hydrenia's world's actually called, I just know that it's like, up until now there hasn't really been any, like, you know, vocalization or anything, so it's just been like, yeah. Well, you're not the person, are you? No, you're just... Sure, I'm hungry. Oh, well, all right. Well, that's a different... You want ten? Jesus Christ! That's a thick-ass... That's like more of like a gruel than a soup. Come on, Uganda. No! Stop being British! <laughs> Is it, no, where, where is this person at? I mean, there's a lot of NPCs, which is cool. Don't mind me. I'm just mooching about. Yes? You say anything? No? 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 Alright. I'll take fish, veggies, and soup. I love me some scran. I love me some scran. <laughs> What does that even mean? What does that even mean? Yeah, this this place is still empty because this is a, a, a modded kind of added place. So I can't imagine there's NPCs in here since... Yeah, this is like the before times. But also, where in the hell is this person that wants this soup? He was walking around, like, near the vehicle place. Looking for something. 
looking for someone. Looking for someone? No! <laughs> God damn, I thought I was rude. Just yelling at them to shut up. But no, you're you're just saying people stink. That's extra rude. <laughs> Cottage supply company. I'm trying to find the person that like wanted this soup, but I'm having difficulty. Like this person has like a name, but like I don't know, like, where they live, what they do, you know, like, it's a little, um, like, I don't know if they, where they work, or what they do, so it's kind of like a needle in a haystack. I've tried to taste logic before. The results were shocking. Well, maybe don't do that. <laughs> maybe don't try to taste electricity, you fuck. So it's not this downtrodden Irishman. It's not those dudes, those twins or whatever. It's not you. He was like walking around here. Maybe he just like wanders around. The, maybe he just wanders the roads looking for soup. <laughs> like some sort of like soup vampire. Just like endlessly traveling the world trying to find soup. <clears throat> he, can, he can only be invited in for soup. <laughs> Where's this dude? No. You, you look like a clone of the other dude. Soup. Please. What I listen, I don't speak British. I don't know what that means. Mildew's aquifer. No, it's not where we're going. I'm. Tr I don't know where this person is that wanted this like six order of soup. <clears throat> He is an elusive soup phantom. <laughs> I need soup. I'm willing to give you guild tokens for soup. Oh, auto save, please. brothers are a bit podgy. What is that? You know what? I don't even want to know what that means. I, I, I've given up at this point. It's like, I don't know what you're saying, and I don't know if I want to know. There's no one else over here. No, no, soup, no soup requesters over here. Fetch me some scrum. Uh, you and your Britishisms. <laughs> it's like Bushisms, but like British. Your Britishisms. It sounds like criticism, <laughs> which is also pretty good. Game really doesn't like when I turn with this cart. Seriously, where is this guy? I'm I'm at a loss because I don't know what to. I, there's nothing I can really do with this soup bowl that I know of, until I find this guy that wanted this amount specifically. Well, I guess in all that time, the tomatoes have probably grown at least, but like, then they can just be added to the rest of the tomatoes. Oh yeah, they're growing up. They're growing up just fine, I think. Yeah, they look hydrated. Look, so that, look, so this is, is a working uh, way to do it. That's good. That person. That's a different job. That's an. That's a different job. Clyde, where the hell is Clyde? All icons are by weight, not quantity. 
by order of the king. Fetch me some soup by the order of the king. Yeah, whatever. Did he, did he decide to like go wander off into the woods to try to ambush me? It's not you. It was like some older looking dude. Well, like some older, not ginger haired looking dude. It's not you, is it? Yeah, I'm sure you are. Uh, we're gonna have to like search the wilderness for this man. Where are you, Arthur? He's the one that got away. Maybe he got, maybe like was walking somewhere and got stuck. <laughs> Well, this is cool. It's like a little, like, a four-wheeler powered by water. Thanks for your business. Maybe before the end of the stream, we can test that out. You made that soup yet? You're a different one, and you want even more tomato. They really want tomatoes. They want a lot of tomatoes. Lloyd! Lloyd Irving wants soup. <laughs> Probably not that Lloyd. Probably a different. That's probably just a different person named Lloyd. Where did he even come from? He just kind of like ap appeared out of nowhere. <laughs> like it's like this game. I'm sure you could. <laughs> Looking for some Fetch me some scram. Oh my God! Why? They're <laughs> fine. Fine. Agnes. The Agnes monster. I mean, if I find someone that wants just six soup, I'll just give it to him because I can't find this. I can't find this dude anywhere. I'm sure it does. And make the go. Oh, oh. So I guess I'm just running around town trying to find this little one dude. I got the goods if you got the cash. Ne I have neither. I have neither the desire or nor the time for that. I'm sure you could. Like this would be a little e I'm just mooching about. <sighs> like this would be a little easier if um I mean you look similar to what that guy looked like, I think, but like I just where? When when I find you, I'm gonna fucking get you. I really wouldn't be surprised if he like despawned somewhere if he's just like stuck. You know, because, like, early access game things sometimes don't really go according to plan. And again, maybe he's, like, is... Fetch me some no, you're, you're a different... Oh, you're you're the one I just got one for. This is, like, your home, I guess. So maybe he's just in a spot I haven't checked yet. He's just, like, lurking in the shadows, waiting for soup. <laughs> he's like a soup... He's like a samurai waiting at the crossroads. Except instead of people to kill, you just want soup. <laughs> a super eye, if you will. <laughs> hey, old lad. I mean, I guess it's fine, because with tomatoes have to grow anyway, but... It's a little annoying to, like, not be able to, like... Yeah. Don't mind me. I'm just mooching about. Can you? That soup yet? Can you? Take a look at my goods. No. Stop harassing me. 
I'm gonna check the lo just the nearby forest, see if he's just kind of like hiding in like the tree line, waiting for soup. <laughs> it's become like a survival horror game of like, where are these motherfuckers? And the they're just waiting for you to bring them soup. It's like they're ghosts and their unfinished business in life is not eating enough soup, so you just you gotta you gotta set them free from the mortal plane. Uh. So I'm just kind of looking around the coast now, I guess. I'm I'm at a loss. So the dude was like walking around near the um. He was walking around near the vehicle place, but that doesn't mean that's like where his like quote unquote home is, because that one dude that I accepted a quest from that was kind of walking around, he eventually got to his home. So I'm kind of lucky I found, figured out where he was. I kind of wish if you were holding the um, the deed, it would like have a, a marker showing, like kind of pointing you in the direction of where they are. Otherwise, you kind of just have to like n either know or kind of guess. All right. Well, it looks like the tomatoes are done, or at the very least, are um, available. Uh, let's see. Did I? Where's the? Where's the chopper? Where's? Where's my chopper? Where's the chopper? There it is. It's in the middle of the floor. I want to see if I can cut one right off of the plant. Mmm, <laughs> yeah. I love, I love, I love dicing vegetables right on the vine. <laughs> that's that's just silly. I love that. All right, let, let's harvest some diced tomatoes. Mmm. <laughs> Get on there. I mean, I guess that's one way to do it. How many tomato we have? 7.4. Mm, in actuality, I bet the little uh, magnet rod would be really good for this kind of situation. For just getting him off the individual thing. I could have sort of had one of those over here like ages ago, but maybe not. So let's go buy a magnet rod. Maybe I can also try to scope out where this soup, <laughs> this soup vampire is. Well, I don't want to clear. I don't want to clear all raw resources, but I'll clear all dunk, ch dunk chirks, chunk dirt chunks. Jesus Christ! All this soup talk is melting my brain. <laughs> Where I can't even like speak coherent sentences anymore. Uh, is he hiding up here? Maybe, like hiding. He's like hanging out here all by his lonesome, waiting. I suppose he could live in like. Is is this? Here he is. This is your home. I found him at least. Okay. I was like, wait, maybe they actually. Maybe he's one of the people that like lives in these like previously abandoned places so we found him at least but I need to go get a um... the little uh, magnet on a stick I feel like I have a feeling that I'll make harvesting these tomatoes a lot easier on on me so I don't have to pick every single up I just left my cart here in the middle of the floor I sure am hungry. Well, we can we we know where this guy lives now at least. So, <clears throat> I wonder if when I found him, he would just like spawned in and was just going to his house. I don't know if like he just like lives here permanently or if like he wanders around too. Like. Remains to be seen. 
But I, I know where you live, Arthur. Could do with some scrum. That's a weak Redley broth, that is. What in the... I don't know what that means, and I'm afraid to ask, but thanks for that. Oh, he, he's... Did he not? Oh, he did give me... He just left the bowl in the fucking bushes. And now that he's... Now that this super empire is... Now that he's received his uh, sustenance, he's on the move. He's gonna find somewhere new to haunt. <laughs> like the soup... The soup demon he is. <laughs> anyway, let's get back. Turned ten eight. Why is that a different person named Arthur? I thought that one person I wanted six was Arthur. I, I don't know. Eight from Agnes. Thirteen for Lloyd, which is the bowl cut looking dude. Uh, I was like, oh, it's Lloyd Irving. And it, it is in fact not Lloyd Irving. That's our our uh, guild, our farting guild tokens. Now I'm assuming since we we're able to chop the tomatoes on the vine, that we'd be able to just pluck them off the vine with this. Kind of. Not like super foolproof. Like these tomatoes seem like they're resistant to the, a little resistant to the pull of the magnet. But it's still probably a lot easier doing it this way than otherwise. Anyway. Uh, I think that's all of them. Oh, that got us a good amount of tomatoes. What is this lag? Tomate nose, got him. I have a feeling this lag is like this combined with like whatever's going on at the Ember Cradle, because like it seems a little. Yeah, I've got a feeling something went wrong back there, and like dirt is just accumulating in a massive amount. Um, I was I meant to go buy a um, I meant to I meant to go buy a um, a sickle from this shop because it let us just clear it let us clear out the uh, plants without getting rid of the plot. Got the goods if you got the cash. Plus it plus we can be we can cause we can be a proper communist now with a sickle or something. Even though this game is most certainly not a communist game. <laughs> it's it's entirely money based. <laughs> I mean you don't have to sell anything if you don't want to, but to like, you know, do things you have to sell stuff. All right, so. All right, neat. So now we can uh, make some more seeds. We have one seed here. We need at least 10.
to there. And some, sometimes they give you two seeds back. So we're going to do these one at a time. So that make sure we don't waste any tomatoes. Alright, so we have ten tomato seeds, so let's replant these. Alright, and then all these tomatoes can be uh, diced up for soup. I could plant more, but I don't really feel like doing that until I get... Um, sprinklers so I can just plant a bunch of them all at once so. mm. yummy dirt tomatoes the best kind you know just a big <laughs> big pile of just messy tomatoes and we'll combine up with our other pile of messy tomatoes all right so we've got 26 okay let's get her a little choppy chop all right so these should each be 13 I know I had I know I had one specifically that needed 13 like a soup thingy I had a watering can around here somewhere I was, I was using it for things other than um, watering flower, flowers, plants, because it can dispense water quite readily on other things. We're, we're, it's probably very obviously somewhere, and I'm just running right by it and not seeing it. Because that's how my brain works. I'll be looking for something and just like completely look over it. Hmm. Literally, yeah. I like I literally said, it's probably in like the middle of the damn floor, and I'm just not seeing it. Okay, so we had one soup bowl that wanted thirteen. So we're just kind of let that sit until it becomes soup. trying to get like 10 that's it's 11.5 we could probably trim off even more of this because I need only like 10 8.3, okay, let's combine that with one of these small piles. See what that gets us. Ten, very, very well, we got 10 there. Okay, and we'll add this to a soup. Uh, get our watering can, which is now a soup making can. It has to heat up a certain temperature. Oh, what? Yeah. Yeah, I, I have a feeling my stuff at the Ember Cradle is a little fucked up. Because I keep getting a lot of lag. We'll, we'll check it out after we head to town. Because I want to buy that uh, little go-kart. Not go-kart. Uh, Four-wheeler. You know, words. Words mean things, right? Maybe. Alright, let's combine our powers. You wanna supify? Yeah, I've I've got a feeling there's like some weirdness going on in them. Like, 
Like, perhaps, like, one of the, uh, perhaps the system's broken, it's just, I don't know. We shall figure it out soon. Those are still growing, which is nice. Okay, let's see, this soup is 13.1, which should be the one for Lloyd. And this one should be 10. I have an idea. I need another tea pipe, though. That way I can still have all this going, but I can have another uh, thing for refilling my water. Alright, so that's good for getting this more soup stuff. So we've got these two soups. Let's leave uh, this bowl behind. We're gonna grab... Uh, or money because we're gonna wanna probably buy something from somewhere I can't remember what it was but I know we, I wanted money oh the fort the little uh, four-wheeler or which is they say it's fast so I guess we'll really put that to the test This be like the first thing we buy. Oh, I meant to grab the money, but it decided to grab the cart instead. Is that where we put stuff? I'm guessing this is where we put stuff and. Like, it's like DoorDash. I wonder if things don't stack like they do in other vehicles. Yeah, they, they don't stack. Like. Ooh. That's quite nice. Quite, quite quick. Okay, you wanted 10. I think. One day I will buy a shiny new truck. I'm sure you will. All right, so yeah, this thing does have a limited inventory space. That's okay. This thing is really quick. Alright, that's fine. I've, I've got like four more minutes left and I'll be ending, so I might be gone when you get back. So enjoy your shower and you have a great day, okay? I'm gonna just give this soup to this dude and then we're gonna go make sure the Ember Cradle's not fucking destroyed because I have a feeling it's la it's this is a lot. There's some severe lag going on. What the fuck does that mean, dude?
Yeah, let's go fetch our bowl. Yeah, it seems like these people like kind of pick a spot to like go on the map. Like I guess they probably have designated spots, and then once you give them their food, they start wandering again, either to somewhere else or I don't know. Like yeah, that person was standing a, in a certain spot, and now they're like not. You know, like they wandered off somewhere else. Yeah, I have a suspicion that the uh, Ember Cradle's got some weird shit going on there. There's a bit of lag. I don't know if that's just like game doing weird stuff. We <laughs> got some air, but I, I I would highly suspect it's got something to do with this system not doing something right and something going really wrong. Oh yeah. Yep, yep, Some, something's wrong. Oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck? Well, I guess that explains the lag. There's gemstones everywhere. <laughs> All right, uh, I, uh. Oh no. That was a mistake. I just activated their, them all at once with this thing. It's going to either crash the game or crash the game. I have a feeling it's not going to be... <laughs> it's probably going to crash the damn game. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, it was nice knowing you. <laughs> I think I legitimately crashed the game. Oh! Oh! It moved! It made a noise! <laughs> God damn it. Why do I always break the game? <laughs> oh my god. So I was thinking it was like dirt was stuck somewhere. No, it's gemstones. You're seeing the exact same thing I am, which is basically a slideshow that somebody hasn't progressed forward with. <laughs> hmm. I mean, it's conveyor belt ASMR. But I think the game's probably hung up. Just a just a hunch that the game's probably just a little hung up. So let me uh We're gonna close the game. Or try to. Oh, no, wait. No, don't close it now. Something happened. I think the game's closed now. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, the game's probably definitely closed now. Come on. Make up your mind. Either closed or you're not closed. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right, task manager, don't let me down now. All right, <laughs> I want to boot that back up to see like if you lost any progress or something. I probably did, because it does auto saves and like the game just you know kind of crashed. So I want to see like kind of where it left me off at.
All right, let's see where it left me off at, because I don't know how when it auto saves. Okay, so apparently we didn't. I got the goods if you got the cash. When did this last auto save? What? What is? What is going on? Do I just have, did this like just revert my world to like some like illegal like half dead state? <laughs> Don't mind me. I'm just or maybe like like which? Okay, you're the one that wanted ten. No, sure oh, there you go. Enjoy. I'm, well I'm sure you're well chuffed indeed. Well, let's go give the. So, well, at least now I know the source of my problem. It is, um, they changed the logic compressor, which my my previous setup used a logic compressor in a certain way, and now that way is no longer valid, and now there's like a billion gemstones everywhere, and I'm going to have to figure that out next stream, because I'm only just redoing this bit here. Yeah, whatever. A little annoyed because it looks like my money's not there. And it looks like I don't have those vehicles, even though I um, definitely bought those vehicles during this stream. It looks like my money might be gone, which that's like probably the least worrisome thing because I can just make more money. Like, it's not hard to make money in this game. Especially with how we're set up, we already have like all that stuff going. But it do, it do, it does seem uh like maybe we like return to like half dead version of our world in part because well damn thing crash because I I made the mistake of eagerly grabbing my <laughs> eagerly grabbing my freaking magnet rod and just yoinking stuff I'm just can I wonder if all my money and stuff is back in uh, here or something. I don't know when yeah, auto saved this stuff because this cart was there with all the with the uh, soups I made, but I had money with me because I had just like bought the uh, because I had just like bought the uh, what you call it the little four wheeler. Which makes me think that the four-wheeler is... Oh, wow, I just somehow can now... I don't know. Maybe that stuff just kind of comes back anyway. But it looks like our tomatoes are done. Either they're done or they're done again. I don't know which one, I don't know which one it is. But I'm going to scoot back to the Ember Cradle and see if my little four-wheeler is there. And if it is, then we'll just call it there. I'm going to call it there anyway because, yeah, it's a little over. The game crashing when I tried to move everything all at once kind of threw a snag in things, admittedly. So we're just going to go on a cross-country jaunt. I might have also accidentally um, duplicated my tomato soups there. Maybe. I guess it depends on if, all, if the stuff that I had on the, uh, the four-wheeler also exists. Because if they do, then that means I inadvertently duplicated some um, coins. Which was not my intention, but I mean, not much I can really do about it. I could throw the stuff away, but that wouldn't really be... Like, the only thing you'd really do would turn it to scrap, maybe. The thing is, I don't know how long back it autosaved either, because like... Yeah, there's, there's no four-wheeler here. Which means that my money is just nowhere, which means it's probably just got deleted somehow. I don't understand.
Like, unless the uh, four-wheeler got forced somewhere else. Yeah, so something broke somewhere. <laughs> Alright, that's kind of funny. We're gonna. We, we sh I probably should have turned this off before last stream anyway. Is like there's there's something going on here. Something they did in their big update uh, broke something fundamentally with this. I'm gonna have to clean it up. But that'll be for next time, cause like yeah, I I I gotta go. <laughs> so that is where the stream for today is ending. With a bit of a, a little bit of a whimper because the game crashed, <laughs> but sometimes that's just how it goes. But thank y'all, thank y'all for coming by and hanging out. Thank you to everyone that lurks. Y'all are awesome too. Oh, uh, let's see. I'll see real quick if someone's re if someone's um, also streaming that I can raid into. But if not, I'm not gonna really put a lot of effort into it. Uh, who's Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to worry about it today. It's, today's a little abnormal, so I'm just going to end the stream. And my next stream should be Saturday, but if something ha comes up, I'll probably say something in the Discord. So if I don't see you uh, next time I stream, I'll see you next time that I see you in general. So have a great day.